My name is Mireille Kayeye and I represent Rea Vivaho, a network of assistance for victims of violence and injustice in Burundi. Rea V works to fight against sexual and gender-based violence. I've been working as a journalist in Burundi and I had an opportunity to see how young girls and women experience sexual and gender-based violence, which leads most of the times to um, sexually transmitted infections with a high rate of HIV. Others experience unwanted pregnancies leading to the school dropout. Burundi is a country with a history of violence and ethnic conflict. It has experienced more than a decade of civil war until 2005 and recently there has been political unrest. Our mission in Reavi is to provide counseling to victims of sexual and gender-based violence, to provide guidance towards the best appropriate legal medical assistance available but also in the long term is to help victims of sexual and gender-based violence become independent especially economically independent and have a second chance in their lives your donations and contributions will directly go to Reavi to help support girls who have experienced sexual and gender-based violence. We have conducted a research recently in December 2016 where 200 girls have been identified. Those girls are girls who have been raped and have had babies, have been stigmatized, are not going at school and would like to have a second chance in their lives. Reavi is going to Provide support to those 200 girls in the next few months with your support. All your donations and contributions are going to help Roya Vibaho to set up the Centre Baho in Burundi, in Bujumbura, but also by providing a weekly training to victims of sexual and gender based violence. Uh, it's gonna set up also that community hub where girls will come and uh, share their stories, interact between themselves and feel empowered and in the longer term every girl will be able to access some training, specific, specific training that's gonna help her to maybe be part of a food production or um, something that's going to be able to economically empower her. Thank you for your support.